An FDA panel is meeting today to discuss whether a new vaccine to protect infants from RSV is safe and effective. As CBS 2's Stephanie Stahl reports, if it gets the green light, the shot would be the first of its kind given to pregnant women. Pfizer's experimental RSV vaccine would be given in late pregnancy so mothers can pass antibodies onto their babies to protect against the virus. Pfizer says its research of nearly 7,400 vaccinated mothers finds the shot is 82% effective at preventing severe RSV in infants in the first three months of life. That number is 69% at six months. RSV pre-F maternal immunization demonstrated a satisfactory safety profile in mothers and their infants. Reviewers with the FDA say the vaccine appears to be safe, but there are some questions about a slight difference in premature birth in the two study groups. The difference of 1% was noted in pre premature births, similar to the difference seen in preterm deliveries, though not statistically significant. These findings may be of consideration for further safety evaluation through post-marketing studies. RSV, which stands for respiratory syncytial virus, can be dangerous, even deadly, for some infants and young children. The CDC estimates about 58 to 80,000 children under five are hospitalized due to RSV. Premature babies and infants under six months old are at highest risk for severe RSV illness. There's nothing more distressing for parents than the frightened look of that three-month-old infant struggling to breathe. The U.S. experienced an unprecedented early and severe surge in RSV cases last fall, putting a significant strain on hospitals. Pfizer predicts up to 16,000 infant hospitalizations could be prevented each year if pregnant women are vaccinated for RSV. Stephanie Stahl, CBS News.